This is a live look at the demonstration. It's aimed at tackling anti-black racism and gun violence in the city. Those taking part spoke about the importance of making their voices heard. We need some committees that are going to oversee and have some racism uh, kind of talks with these, with, with these officials that are going to kind of let them understand why some of the things they do might be racist or might be prejudiced. Because some people might not know that they're doing something that is prejudiced. So there needs to be these conversations and these things need to happen soon. I think it was very important for us to be here today to get our voices heard because we believe that we've suffered at the hands of our oppressors for many, many years now. And um, we've sat back, we've, we've tried our best, we've spoken to so many people, but all these things have been done under, you know, in the dark, behind closed doors, but not out in the public where everybody can see us and hear our voices and to really take us seriously. So seeing the death of Breonna Taylor and George Floyd, and obviously George Floyd even more so, that shed shockwaves around the world, we had to not sit back, we had to come out, we had to do something. We had to make our voices heard and stand up and say, you know, we want to be counted to, to represent our people and people of colour who have suffered this, this kind of atrocities for 400 years.